Hi, Church of the Valley. I'm Marie Ortiz, and I've been going to Church of the Valley for a little over a year. Um, my husband died in January of 2019, and it was pretty awful. But at that time, um, so many of you reached out and helped us um, financially to help bring him home so we could bury him and help with the burial expenses and you hadn't even met me you know and on top of it then I met Tim who spoke at his funeral and I was just so impressed how um, how many people came and helped my children feed them while, while I was gone and made me feel comforted that they were going to be okay and we were okay because of you and because of God's blessings through you um, you were Jesus with skin on. So I started going because of that um, and really fell in love with, you know, not just Tim's preaching and, you know, and, and Mike's and how it integrates the Bible, not just the verse of the day, but various passages, but also at how many of you are so in love with Jesus and are so determined at deepening your relationship with him. Um, because it is a relation, right? Um, and like with any relation, you're going to have the roller coaster sometimes where you go way up and then way down. And then, you know, sometimes it ebbs and it flows and sometimes it flips you around. And, but eventually you come to a landing and it calms down. And that's kind of what life feels like right now, or it has at least for the past year. And I feel like we're on another roller coaster dip again. But what I do know, and, and Tim asked me to um, talk about where I'm at, is that God has shown over and over to me um, through you, through others, through circumstances, like the fact that I'm not alone in my home um, after Louis' death, that his presence is there um, through all your circumstances, that we're not alone, and he has a plan, you know? And I can talk to him, I can weep, I can... I can show my frustration, I can show my anger, but you know what, he's gonna love me and his grace is gonna be there no matter what. And I find it easier to find calm in this storm along with the others that I've been through. And I'm very grateful for God's grace. And I know that no matter what happens, it doesn't matter so much, I'm at peace because I know the end goal. And so it's so much easier now that I reflect on that, I can reflect on that, and I can reflect on the blessings that I have, including all of you. Love you.